waste of a good breakfast. Huh. What do you think just got knocked over? David, are you out of your mind? You waste what I make, and then you ask me to make you more. Just some coffee will be fine. Oh, why do I even bother? <sighs> fine, fine. Can't start a good day without a good breakfast. Now sit down. I'll let you off easy today. What happened with Diana? Oh. Why are you asking me that? Hey, you've hardly touched your meal. You know how it is. Same old, same old. Mm. Something more serious than clam chowder this time? This one's a bit different. It'll be okay, David, right? Things just got a little bit complicated right now. It'll work itself out. It will? Yeah, it, it will. Still, I can't help but feel that all you two ever do is fight. And you never even seem to entertain the notion of splitting up. <laughs> You've got quite a strange relationship. Well, I may have met her here. But we're both from New York originally. We think alike, you know? <laughs> so, then why all the fights? I guess. It's probably my fault. Yeah. Take, if you will, this hot dog. What's this Frank made from, huh? Pork, right? That's right. Ah. Here in Boston, when you say hot dog, people think pork. But in New York, it's all about beef. In other words, for Diana, even hot dogs meet beef. She doesn't like that you eat pork hot dogs? She thinks I've forsaken my hometown. She can't forgive me for that, so she gets all tough on me. So she loves you, but she also loves her hometown just as much. Yeah. Will I ever be able to win out against the Big Apple? God only knows. You said it. Well, that was interesting. Um, good God. Quite the release for something that just came out, you know. You. Give me some for five vision. Take this. Trade off. Hmm. What to 
put on what to put on. So she's like cat lady thing. Okay. Oh. You can wear. There you go. You can be a cowboy. Let's pander. Damn it. I don't think that should turn green. So we need to go to the past. This one's gonna be as long as the first one. I mean, holy crap. David! You can't change the past. Facing the past changes your perception of it. This memento, it's the same. You didn't change the past. Just how you proceed. Eddie, you always help me out. Thanks, partner. Hey, David! Oh, Teddy, I'm sorry. No matter what you say, I'm not giving up. I'm gonna find Dee and save her life. That's why I need the courier's evidence. Olivia. Um. So, we're below the seats now. 
bloodstains? What happened after the lightning strike? Huh. Olivia. Don't move. How did you get down here? Just who the hell are you? I'm a private detective. David Young. Formerly a detective with the BPD. I used to wear a badge too. You think I'll buy that? Huh. That's up to you. Delta calling Eagle. Delta calling Eagle. The Federal Marshal. Derek Buchanan got my gun. He's taking the target. The marshal's moving the courier. Then we need to get up there. I said don't move! I'm leaving. Move back again and I'll shoot! No, you won't. I can't let you go. There's something I have to do. Ah! <laughs> I'll share my shoulder, if you'll share your radio and gun. A temporary ceasefire. Can I trust you? Like I said, that's up to you. Okay. This is the space below the passenger seating. If we move between the luggage, we'll be able to reach below the cockpit. Let's now let's hurt. Looking closely, the differences become quite clear. But she still bears a strong resemblance to little Peggy. Uh, is something the matter? Well, let's just keep moving. Okay. Find in here? Expensive tequila. For D. I know, I know. Fight, David. Little Peggy. Wait. Am 
I supposed to see the world in 4D? both ways. Okay. No sense in looking through other people's luggage. As we look through other people's luggage. Valuable lesson. What was? Huh? Gas is spurting out. That should do it. Always good to put a lid on dangerous things. So much dialogue. Hmm. Yeah, I meant to push the little Shit. things. How can this thing be flying? Gum do you have? <laughs> that should do it. Always good to put a lid on dangerous things. Exactly. It's caught on something. I have to free it up somehow. the marshal take Antonio Zapatero hostage? I have no idea. You're one to talk anyway. Seems like you'll do just about anything for your investigation. Are you really just a private detective? I'm going after the courier, at the request of the BPD. The BPD? Your people asked for the cooperation. I wasn't aware of that. <laughs> Sorry, I meant, will ask. Huh? <laughs> 